students, and welcome. Today we'll be discussing comparing and contrasting two texts on the same topic. Compare and contrast informational text. I can compare and contrast the most important points and key details presented in two texts on the same topic. Compare and contrast. Using the Venn diagram, work with your class to list all the similarities and differences you can think of between dogs and cats. When you compare between two texts on the same topic, you identify what is the same. When you contrast between two texts on the same topic, you identify what is different. Drag the words into the correct box. So they've given you both, although similar, however, as opposed to contrary to alike. And these are how we separate them. Compare, we have both similar and alike. Contrast, we have although, however, as opposed to and contrary to. A Venn diagram is a diagram that can be used to compare similarities and differences between two things. To compare is to say how something is similar to something else. This information goes in the center. To contrast is to say how something is different from something else. This information goes in the outer circle. Place the differences between the two texts in the large parts of the circle. Then place the similarities between the two in the center. Comparing two texts, blue whales, blue whales are the largest animals currently on earth. These whales can grow up to 100 feet long and weigh up to 200 tons. Their diet consists of shrimp, which they eat up, to four tons in a single day. Blue whales have been found in every ocean in the world. In the world, They swim in small groups, but are usually found alone or in pairs. Animals migrate or move to a different place for many reasons. Blue whales migrate to eat and to have their young in warmer waters. This text is also about whales. So let's read this one. Whales. Whales are mammals, so they breathe air, are warm-blooded, nurse their young, and have body hair. They have a layer of fat under their skin called blubber that helps keep them warm in the cold ocean water. They breathe through blowholes by shooting air out of the blowholes and inhaling into their lungs. The blue whale can hold its breath for 40 minutes and sperm whales can stay underwater for up to 120 minutes. Whales are estimated to live up to 77 years. Here is a Venn diagram where we are comparing and contrasting information. So we're just going to move the information to the right bubble. Blue whales and what we read, blue whales describe blue whales and their diet. In the Blue Whale article, it also talks about how they can grow up to 100 feet long and 200 tons. And it defines migration and why blue whales migrate. And this one 
explains why whales are mammals and how whales can live up to 77 years. So here's our second one where we're comparing two other texts. The first one is staying safe during hurricanes. A hurricane is a dangerous storm. This type of storm has high winds. It can bring a large amount of rain. It is important to watch the news and have a plan. During a hurricane, it is important to stay inside. Stay away from windows. If there are warnings to evacuate or leave your home because of danger, follow the directions. Hurricanes are dangerous storms because they are large and sometimes slow moving. There are important steps to take to prepare and to be safe during and after the storm. It is important to be aware and ready. The second article is talking about hurricanes as well. It's called Famous Hurricanes. There, has, there have been many devastating hurricanes to hit the United States. They have been large natural disasters. It is important to stay indoors during a hurricane. Hurricane Katrina was a deadly storm that flooded many homes. Hurricane Sandy flooded streets and subways. Hurricane Harvey ranged over 50 inches. Many hurricanes do not bring as much damage as, their, as these hurricanes did. Hurricane Katrina, Hurricane Sandy, and Hurricane Harvey are just a few of the most notable ones in the United States. Compare and contrast. Which text would you read to determine how to prepare for a hurricane? And question two is, what is the main purpose of famous hurricanes? For one, they gave us the option of A, staying safe during hurricanes, B, famous hurricanes, and C, both. For question two, it gave us A, it tells you what to do in a, in a case you find yourself in a hurricane. B, it discusses the major hurricanes that have happened in the United States. And C, it tells you why it is important to stay inside during a hurricane in heavy storms. If you said A for one, which text would you read to determine how to prepare for a hurricane? Staying A is staying safe during hurricanes. You are correct. B, I mean number two, I'm sorry. Number two, what is the main purpose of, of, of famous hurricanes? If your answer was B, it discusses the major hurricanes to have happened in the United States. You are correct. Why do you think it's important to compare and contrast? Being able to compare and contrast similar texts can help you choose the most useful text when you are searching for information. I know where to find the information I need. If I want to know the names of some hurricanes that have happened in the United States, I'll read famous hurricanes. Comparing two texts, reading both passages, keep an eye out for any similarities and differences. Text one, boa constrictors are amazing snakes that can weigh over 100 pounds. Like all snakes, boa constrictors are reptiles and cold-blooded. These snakes are not poisonous and kill their prey by wrapping their bodies around and squeezing them until they die. They can be found in Central and South America. Text two, boa constrictors can be as small as 30 inches and as big as 10 feet. The biggest one ever found was over 18 feet long. They can weigh over 100 pounds. These snakes eat almost anything they can catch. They eat birds, monkeys, and even pigs. They search for their meal in the dark of night. Compare and contrast any points or details you notice between the text and slide to review a few, uh, reveal a few possible answers. So compare 
both texts, they both describe boa constrictors. Both texts state that boa constrictors can weigh up to 100 pounds. When we contrast, text one explains how boa constrictors eat their prey. Text one also says where boa constrictors are found. Text two says what boa constrictors eat, and text two states the typical size of boa constrictors. Compare and contrast two texts on the same topic. Words like similar and also indicate a comparison. If you said true, you are correct. Statements like contrary to and on the other hand indicate a contrast. If you said true, you are correct. are describing Africa, but one is focusing on the climate while the other is focusing on the animals. This is a comparison. False. If you said false, you are correct. These books are both describing the effect of fast food on health. This is a comparison. You said true, you are correct. are describing bees, but one is focusing on their role in the environment while the other is focusing on how they make honey. This is a comparison. You said false, you are correct. Both texts below and then answer this question. Which text would you read if you wanted to get more information about an African safari? Animals that are from Africa are some of the most fascinating animals to see. If you've ever dreamed of seeing the animals that live in Africa, you can visit a local zoo or go on an African safari. Africa is home to many amazing... Eating from tall trees, elephants spring water from their noses, and lions laying in the sun. You said text two, you are correct. What did you learn? I can compare and contrast the most important points and key details presented in two texts on the same topic. How can texts on the same topic be similar and different? Spin the wheel. Answer the questions that correspond to the numbers. Can you name a word that signifies a contrast between two items? Can you name a word that signifies a comparison between two, uh, two items? Tell your classmates why do you think comparing and contrasting several texts is important. 